His palms are sweaty, knees weak, arms are heavy. There's vomit on his sweater. Oh, back to reality. What's up YouTube, it's your boy Dirty Dave. In this video, I'm very excited to show you guys the art of impact tricking. It's a very useful tool to have up your sleeve and a lot of high level players and pro players use this trick. And it's using an impact grenade to deny hard breaching. So in this video, I'm gonna show you guys two solid examples on how to impact trick a hatch and a reinforced wall. And then after that, I'm gonna show you guys useful impact tricks on the majority of the rank maps. So this video was prepared before Operation Wind Bastion. So I did not have it for Fortress, but if you guys do enjoy the video, I can make an impact trick video only for Fortress. And also with Operation Wind Bastion, the way you throw grenades has changed. So that's changed for impact grenades. But to be honest, they made it easier because now where you throw or where you aim is where the grenade goes. As before, you had to compensate for the arc. So let's get right to this. I have my buddy playing thermite and he's gonna put his exothermic charge on the farthest corner from where I'm gonna impact trick. So right there, quick second, you saw the sink to the right of the hatch, which is east of the hatch right here, you gotta see it. So I made the hole through the floor because I'm gonna be throwing my impact grenade on the base of the sink to destroy the impact or the exothermic charge. So being you guys saw right there. So the base of the sink is obviously higher than the floor. So the explosion is going to go over the hatch and take out whatever's on the hatch. Habana pellets and thermites, exothermic charge, obviously it doesn't work against Maverick. So right here, putting his charge at crouch level. So you can 100% you can counter thermite this way, but not Habana. I'll get to that in a second. So he's going at it and then I boom, I throw my impact grenade against the ceiling on the other side of the wall and we take it out. So right here, I'm just messing around with my friend a little. So there's really like two, only two ways to counter this. One, and it's like obvious, kill the person who's impact tricking, which is pre pretty hard to do. Uh, impact tricking a hatch is almost guaranteed. But with the wall, Habana can beat the impact trick because if she does it at the floor level at the base, the impact grenade does not reach far enough to hit the destroy the pellets on the bottom of the reinforcement. But anywhere else, like you guys saw that crouch there my charge it could take that out so that's that so now i'm showing you guys border and bank as the first two rank maps and i'm showing you guys these first because honestly these are like game changing i never see people do this so right here when you're defending customs and stock you can actually impact trick this outside wall so i'm using my smoke canister as the thermite charge or habana pellet so i'm gonna be throwing my impact grenade on the little arc other side of the reinforcement and it destroys the canister so it will destroy the pellets or charge and like I mentioned earlier the way you throw impact grenades has changed so you don't have to compensate that much so right here I have it at two times speed just to save us some time and I'm showing you guys where to throw your impact grenade to deny the hatch so this one's pretty nice right here too so this is the hatch in archives and you'll be throwing it under a desk and this one's that's a guaranteed every time to deny that hatch that's pretty awesome so right here I'm gonna show you guys uh, another example with the canister. So the first hatch that I showed you was right there in middle CCTV. And I'm showing you the desk right there. So this is here in the closet. And I'm gonna throw my impact grenade against the cabinet. Boom, I take it out. So I shoot a hole right there so you guys can see that there's no yellow gas coming out. So this one right here, this one's pretty nice as well for archives. So I'm destroying the top of the wall from the other side. So this, I kind of forgot to mention this earlier, but impact tricking on walls only works when there's space above the reinforcement, which not every map has that. Coastline and Skyscraper are the two. So right here, I destroyed from the other side because um, this is actually a very tough impact trick to get. And if you destroy the ceiling, you might get it between the metal bars, which will mess it up. So I'm trying to preserve the ceiling. So I like right there, you can see it's kind of destroyed and I'm showing that the vertical metal bar kind of goes all the way through. So this is very hard to do, but now with the new throwing mechanics, I think it'll be easier. This is one you should definitely practice and it's pretty dirty. So I got it through. So with that one, well, I guess it doesn't matter. I was going to explain how to line that up, but with the new impact or the new grenade changes, it'll be easier and just might have to compensate a little for that arc because it is a very tight spot. So that was for archives and that is a great spot to impact trick. And this is for skylight. So right here, 
shooting it out this side doesn't really matter the ceiling's indestructible using uh, my habana pellet example and we're just gonna impact this so i'm doing this for a majority of the maps and after this we'll go back to two times speed showing the other uh walls that you can do this on so right there it shows so now i'm gonna just run around two times speed you know i feel like i'm talking at two times speed so this is also a good wall tellers to lobby great wall you cannot do it on the tellers to hallway though here in open area i'm sure you can do it on every wall i'm just showing these walls an example because that's where i like to put my mirror windows so if there's a bonnet trying to snipe out my mirror windows you can impact trick that as well without putting yourself in danger to shoot them out so you can deny a skylight wall as well and then we go in here second floor so i'm just mainly showing you guys walls that will probably be a hard breach not 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 necessarily always hard breach but maybe some cases they will so right here uh, the reception walls to executive and then right there so these uh, this next wall i'm gonna show you guys is for another mirror that i like to use watch is uh, the stock training room and then we'll get on to the next map so i'm recording this or i'm talking after this was recorded so kind of the remind thing so right there you cannot impact check that wall but i was just showing that because the pro levels or the pro players they would impact check that wall constantly and they had to stop it because that's how powerful it is they actually filled it in with a cinder block so again two times speed just showing you guys walls they can do it on not necessarily that you might want to do it on but just showing you that you can this one was actually done in pro play as well pretty nice right here yeah, I like to put my mirror windows on that so if Habana tries to snipe it, you can impact check that. You cannot on that one, which is unfortunate because that's a popular wall. Right here you can, but it's not very safe because there's a window to your right to take you out. And then here on the garage walls, you can. Now this one's actually pretty easy because it has like a metal covering, like I guess to reinforce the garage wall. And so that one's pretty easy. For this one on Oregon, I actually did it myself. And it's a bit different from the rest so with this one you know it's really common for people to stand on top of the stairs and just shoot out the habana pellets or just throw the impact grenade from there so right here standing on top of the stairs habana sniping them from the lobby door but in this case we're only going to shoot out some like say four out of the six habana pellets we're going to let two of them go off because the other two they're going to make holes and you can throw your impact grenade through the holes to smack them against the reinforced wall that was next to the hatch right here. Hereford base, honestly there's not that much you can do. But here's the hatch that goes into a brewery and chamber. I'm just showing you where you can, uh, where you should make your shotgun holes. And then throw your impact through there. So some of the hatches that you have to impact trick would be like this. And it's a little bit, makes you a little bit more vulnerable. But it's important hatches to deny so right here you can throw on that side you don't have to open up as much as i do but it's just showing you guys your options so right here this cafe one is very nice i really like this cafe one when you're defending a uh, oil and fireplace so that's my habana pellet and we're gonna impact trick against that chair so i'm gonna get down there so it's a lot easier to do with the new um the throwing mechanics so you guys see me a lot compensating for the impact grenade arc. So right there, I'm kind of like aiming at the metal bars. And there I take out the canister and you guys can see there's no yellow smoke. And that's just to prove it to you. So now, two times speed running around showing you guys which walls you'd want to do it on. So you can do it on this wall from freezer to scar lounge. Be careful you don't get shot from skylight. Do it on the white wall or from white stairs to fireplace. You can do it right there. And then we'll go down to kitchen and this is really common ball to place your mirror so if they try to snipe your uh your mirror window you can take it out from there so this is i think pretty sure the rest of the video is at two times speed so i'm still here with you guys talking so this uh nothing too crazy i think honestly i think every wall and villa can be impact tricked because impact tricked impact tricked because all the walls are higher than the reinforcement. So this one is actually a key wall and I'm gonna show the another example with my canister right here around the middle of the wall. So if you guys have any questions or whatever, if I need to clarify anything, please uh, be sure to make a comment. I definitely respond. I know I'm kinda talking a lot. I'm kinda doing this on the spot. So 
it's very easy for me to miss something so i'm just running around showing you guys everything you do just the possible walls that would be hard breach so definitely practice this yourself because seeing me doing it won't be enough for you guys to master it and it's definitely such a great trick to have so i right hear just literally i think yeah i think every wall except for the basement level you can impact trick but that doesn't matter because there's no objectives down there so that one and it's honestly surprising how high the or how big the radius of the impact grenade is because that ceiling right there was pretty high but it still got it i tested it out myself i tested out a majority of these walls so right here on theme park none of the second floor walls you can impact trick but all of the first floor walls you can impact trick so again showing the possible walls that would get hard breached right there you can impact trick and i'll show this example again right there so bam i think i'm not sure if this is the last map all oh, right here consulate yeah so consulate i had to redo so this one honestly this is like the only wall i'm gonna show you guys there's not that much to show but if you're holding the closet and console you can uh impact trick by bouncing off the walls to the side so took out that one and you guys definitely i didn't mention this earlier but you can definitely put the video at have speed uh if it's too fast for you and then right here if you're holding down meeting room and sometimes it's you actually should reinforce that wall and make a rotation on the other side so we try to abandon you from the back you're okay but that's it for the video if you guys enjoyed please leave a like and if you want more great day subscribe until then see you guys next time thank you for watching